Good news, and I have some bad news. The bad news is, I'm sorry, but Ed DeMarco is unable to be here today. I know, I know, I'm just as disappointed as all of you are. But the good news, speaking for Ed DeMarco, will be my boss, Dr. Evil. <laughs> Thank you, number two. Many of you fine people gathered here assume that Ed DeMarco, the acting director of the Federal Housing and Finance Agency, would be here today to make an important announcement. Right. April Fool's. <laughs> but he sent me Dr. Evil in his place. Usually I'm talking to the public about giant lasers and liquid hot magma. Not today. So here goes. As you know, the FHFA is the federal agency that runs Fannie Mae and Freddie Mac. That means it owns two thirds of all the mortgages in America. And over 13 million American families are underwater on their mortgages, meaning that the homes they purchased are worth less than what they bought them for. And being underwater is the number one risk factor leading to foreclosure, more so than getting sick or getting laid off. So some people <coughs> have suggested that mortgage relief in the form of principal reduction is the natural solution to the housing crisis. And sure, FHFA has the power to do just that. But as you know, itself issued a report stating that the principal reduction would help stop the housing crisis and be good for the economy. But how about now? So here are Ed DeMarco's terms. In exchange for reducing principal for underwater homeowners, we demand one million dollars. Throw me a bone here, people. Okay. In exchange for reducing principal for underwater homeowners, we demand one trillion dollars. Enough, 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 I want to first thank you all who are here for coming today. And, and now that we've given Dr. Evo a chance to speak, it's time to get serious. I am one of 13 plus million underwater homeowners. I owe approximately $60,000 on my home. My home is worth less than $2,000 right now. We are here today, we are here today to ask President Obama to replace the Federal Housing and Finance Agency Director in the name of Ed DeMarco with someone, anyone, who will issue mortgage relief for underwater homeowners. In 2008 and 2009, as the banks crashed, the housing market by first inflating it and then betting against it, it was the taxpayers who bailed out the banks. People like me, Debbie Adams to my left, members of my congregation, the people of Detroit, and the whole country bailed out the banks with our money, but somehow, that bailout never trickled down to the homeowners like myself, who continue to lose their homes. The likely total for 2012 will be over 200, two million, I'm sorry, two million people. If the FHFA allows Fannie Mae and Freddie Mac 
to continue principal reduction for mortgages. They hold foreclosures, they will come to a stop. But we know that Ed DeMarco was unwilling to do that. It's time for a new director of Fannie Mae and Freddie Mac. What I'd like to do now is introduce to you Debbie Adams, who will share her struggle to save her. 